want to share briefly how this, when this nigun came down. <coughs> Those of you uh, that are from New Jersey, from Pesek, you know, Baruch Hashem, my family, our roots are, are deep in Pesek, way before Pesek became a Pesek Yir HaKodesh. There was barely a minion there. And uh, my, my, my mother was born there. And uh, on one Erev Shabbos, it must be now, wow, it must be like 17 years ago now, 16, 17 years ago. I went to go visit my grandparents' kvarm as close as I could get as, as a Kayan. Back then it was possible because there was nothing else there. And I realized that I don't think I ever wished them a good Shabbos properly. I, 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 that's what came to my heart, to my mind. So right away at that moment, and this usually doesn't happen, but a, a, a nigun came down with words immediately. I felt like a wind just going inside and out, and I had to hop it really fast. And uh, it came down with this nigun, but also in Yiddish, which I, I never happened before. But when I sing the Shabbos Kurdish, I'm thinking about wishing my grandparents a good Shabbos. This is how it came down originally. Oh, yo, 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 mama zisa. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Good Shabbos, good Shabbos. Dear mother, dear father, sweet mother, sweet father, all of you, everyone, good Shabbos, good Shabbos. And uh, I just kept on singing it over and over again. I have Shabbos, came back to Eretz Yisrael. And I realized it's a, it's, it's a strong second part. It doesn't have a first part, and it's in Yiddish, so I don't know who was, you know who would sing it. But in my heart, that's what I'm singing. That's what I'm singing whenever we sing this nigun. But let's just say, let's sing this one more time. The Shabbos Kodesh, and please have in mind anyone that uh, anyone that you wish you could have wished them a good Shabbos, and in this world you didn't have a chance to. One time. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Shabbos to our beautiful children, those of us that have children, those of us that soon be Yisrael Hashem in the right time will have healthy, beautiful children. Just think about them for a second. How much if you if if you they could X-ray your heart, they'd see what do you want to give them? What do you want to give them? You want to give them Shabbos? You know, Reb Shlomo wrote the Nigun Mizemar Mizemar Shabbos. Where did he write this Nigun? He was doing a husband for his father at his father's, at his father's uh, funeral. And he realized that a lot of people leave their children real estate, other goods, whatever it is. And he's thinking to himself, you know, well, what did my father leave? What's my Yerusha? It's like Shabbos. So right there in Harman Ochos, that's where Reb Shlomo, that's where the Nigan came down, where the whole world is waiting to sing the song of Shabbos. But just like have in mind your, your, your children, our children, have in mind each other's children, children, grandchildren. Shabbos should be clear, the kaiman should be lasting, guarding them, they should be guarding it. Oh, yo, yo, yo. yourself a good Shabbos. Just wish yourselves a real, real, real strong kashrut, a connection to this tima of what's going to be when Mashiach comes, Yom Shukur Shabbat. How much we long for Shabbos, and Shabbos comes, and 
we're always like, oh, I wish, I wish it could have been like this. So ask yourself, ask yourself, what do I long for most? I long for most to be in the moment. I long the most when Shabbos comes, Shani Shama, I'm there, I'm there. So it starts right now, this second. So just wish yourselves now, the strong one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah.